Lena is famous for being an overly attached girlfriend. So today I'm going to meet up with her for an interview. Then I'm going to ask her on a date. And then we're going to get married and be together forever. So it turns out you're pretty hot. Yes. You can be overly attached to me if you want. No, thank you. Why won't you be overly attached to me? I'm not actually overly attached in real life. So, and if I were to be overly attached to someone, it probably would maybe be someone else. How many people have you murdered? Um, just like, not that long, maybe like a handful, not a whole lot. That's not much. No. I mean, in moderation, yeah. murder is fine. Yeah. <laughs> that must suck to be famous for a weird stare. Yes. Oh. Okay. <laughs> if I was your girlfriend, I'd never let you leave Without a small recording device taped under your sleeve And you'll only, I like, can see your hand <laughs> in the TV It's like the most awkward interview I've ever done If it makes you feel more comfortable, I can do this Nothing is making me feel comfortable right now You're from Texas I am That's why you talk like this You don't talk like that at all What do you think of Texas? You think we ride around on horses? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. And then you eat the horses. <laughs> That's exactly what we do. What are your pet peeves? Um, I don't like it when people make gross noises with their mouth. <laughs> Not like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'ma make you stay with me and be mad if you don't. Girl, girlfriend, girlfriend, I will be your girlfriend. I will be your girlfriend. I will be your girlfriend. Do you read YouTube comments? Yes. What's the meanest thing somebody's wrote? Um, Can you do that tongue thing again? No. I'm just gonna put that in slow motion. Okay. Why don't you ever blink? I don't ever want to not see you. That's romantic. Thanks. When girls come to my house, I make them wear this. Uh, <laughs> I have nothing to say to that. The creepiest part is that you took the time to cut, so... No, you didn't. You just ripped it. <laughs> I didn't have a scissors. A scissors? Can I have one of your hairs? <laughs> yes. Let's see. You're so welcome. Now we can be together forever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if I was your boyfriend, I would never leave. I'd put a recording device in your sleeve, tape all your conversations, then I would play them in the bathroom when I'm doing masturbation. Please text me when you're on your cycle. Let's have a staring contest. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> I won. That doesn't count. That counts. You, One. You didn't say no cheating. Two, three. I didn't say no cheating. That's what they do in basketball. Okay. No. <laughs> they do that in football. I don't think so. Ready? No cheating. One, two, three. <laughs> You're really good at this. Uh, <laughs> I won. I'm the new overly attached girlfriend. Oh. That's not how that works. That's how the crown's passed. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. It's me now. You can ask. We already chose a name. And I already chose a dame. That's right, this is Joe's flame. She says maybe I should get some rogue gain. Overly attached girlfriend. Na 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 yeah subscribe to badge of shame what's your most embarrassing moment uh when i was in first grade i went to the bathroom and i pooped and then i realized that my underwear was still up so i pooped in my underwear 
So then I waddled out to my teacher and I told her that I had poop in my underwear. <laughs> and that was it. I'm not attracted to you anymore. <laughs> <laughs>